I'm Tony. I'm Rachel. Back with some more Grim Dawn. We're in Homestead. Uh, yes, we are in Homestead. If you want to see Rachel's view, top upper right hand corner or description below. Yep. All right. Um, we are in the Homestead, and I don't even remember what button does the thing I wanted to do. There we go. <laughs> okay, so. Clear out the. So we need to go to the other camp real quick. We do. So let's maybe come outside, make a port, and do that first. Why do we need to go outside to make a port? We don't necessarily, but it just puts us closer to where we need to be. Or I guess that is a port outside. Yeah, I, thought you I forgot there was a port outside. That makes more sense. Okay, so we need If you to... notice, Homestead's got like a... Or maybe that's because that's the one we're coming from. But it's kind of golden colored. It is. Okay, so we need to go to... Uh, where was it now? Dead Man's Gulch? Smuggler's Pass? Where were those people? Uh, Dead Man's Gulch has got that list of where the cook was. I think it's that, yeah, Dead Man's Gulch. Because okay. that was the guy that was injured next to the cook that was laying on the ground. Okay, yep. Yes. Go. Yeah. Alright, I'm starting with cook. So how doomed are we? I've secured the way via rift gate. Good work. I can't say I enjoyed my first travel by rift, but it's certainly better than the alternative. I'll see y'all on Homestead. Ah, crap. Oh, well, Should there talk they to go. The <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess we'll see them in Homestead. Yep. Oh, don't stand in the green. Green pad. Uh, oops. Yeah, there we go. Let's see where they got things. to. Oh, those are bad guys. I saw some people standing out there. I was trying to figure out what that was. Hmm. Alright, looks like right here. Did you find my sister? Yes, she was in the mountain deeps. I'm sorry. I I had a feeling. Thank you for the information. I excuse me. Uh, I'm Aww. sorry. Sorry, buddy. Yeah, Thank you for giving sucks. me closure. Aww. Yeah. Okay, so we need to clear the fields for him. That's Vendor. Yeah. Um. Stay on your guard. The enemies of humanity are all around us. Can you open the gate? Got any stories from the front lines? Hey, let's listen to some stories. Yeah, sounds good. If you have to go back out there, steer clear of the reanimators. They are the gangly skeletal creatures with ether crystals embedded in their backs. They spread misery with their very existence. Their touch ignites the earth with ether fire. But most despicable of all is their ability to raise the dead to do their bidding. It is one thing to watch your comrade die in battle. It is entirely another to then have him put back into the dirt because he has become an undead puppet. I don't wish such a thing upon anyone. Ugh. Yep. Um, there's a person up here to talk to, actually. Okay, let's go talk to the person up here. Where's that? Oh, there's the bounty table, actually. Should we get the one for reanimators? Step away from the bounty. I can't uh, actually get one from this one. Okay, because we're not here. You dragged all of them's sorry ass out of Deadman's Gulch. Good work. Come see me later. Perhaps we can put your skills to some use. I take it you don't like Olgrim? Say the Olgrim is the Black Legion have his okay. She's voiced for like half of it. <laughs> okay. It's showing back yeah. here. Oh, there here it we is. go. I wasn't sure you'd make it, but you pulled through. Those people owe you their lives. I did what was right. I wish that was the end of our troubles, but there is a mounting threat on the horizon that threatens to wipe us all out. What do we do now? I'm going to check in with Creed here, but I suggest you speak to Captain Somer. She's the Black Legion officer in charge of this sorry bunch. Look for the grumpy middle-aged hag in Black Legion armor. She will fill you in on the situation. I will speak with her. Grumpy so middle-aged hag. Yeah. <laughs> I have some questions. This is Inquisitor Creed. Hmm. Uh, if you have something to say, make it quick. How do you know Olgrim? How did you escape the Warden Creek's lab? Hmm. Um, I'm curious on that one. Yeah. As an Inquisitor, I had access to many occult artifacts and relics that had come into the safekeeping of the Luminari. Some that were deemed more benign were occasionally lent out to veteran Inquisitors, and I have used them to great advantage. Creek underestimated that. I have another question. How do you know Olgrim? I've long known of Olgrim by his previous title, the First Blade, although I was fortunate to not have to meet him in his working capacity back then. 
It was not until the days prior to the Grim Dawn that I met him in person. It was our mutual awareness of the ethereal conspiracy and individual inability to counter it that brought us together. In the end, we realized the ether ethereals already controlled too much of the government and could not be stopped. So we instead set out to gather resources and allies to weather the invasion and launch a resistance. I see. I see. All right. And... I'm oh, stuck on post. Here. It's a... Uh... Oh, okay. It's the hag. <laughs> <laughs> I'll skip the pleasantries. Orgrim tells me you're one tough slith, and right now that's what I need most. Will you fight for the Black Legion? Um, what's the Black Legion? Yes. You are joking, right? We are the Imperium's most infamous, if not elite, legion. Conscripted from criminals and political outcasts and temperate in the front lines of the Empire's most brutal wars. The only regiment of the Emperor's legions that has survived the massacre in the capital. If you could consider the losses we suffered surviving. I'd love to tell you our history, but I really have more important matters to attend to. Such as the mission I need you for. The question really is, are you up to it? Uh, where do you need me? Yeah. The legion is split on two fronts. To the north, we have the cult of Cathan. Nasty bastards keen on turning all of us into a puddle of blood for their rituals. I have my best men out there right now scouting ahead. The cultists are amassing in great numbers, and I'd like to know why. There is a more pressing issue, however, and this is where you come in. Olgrim says that you are experienced with fighting the Ethereals. That's good. You'll need all your skills for this one. Far to the west, beyond the infested farms and the rotting croplands, there is an area teeming with ethereals that we have started calling the Gruesome Harvest. It is a fitting title as the ethereals have been gathering corpses, animal and human alike, in order to conduct their sick resurrection techniques upon them. The barn there has been giving off a blinding aether light non-stop for the last few days and nights. That is, until today. Whatever they are working on, it must be nearly finished. And knowing the Ethereals, it's something monstrous. We can't risk the Ethereals discovering that we know about their creation. I need someone to sneak in there and destroy this abomination before it even has a chance to wreak havoc upon my people. We'll only get one shot at this, so I want someone who has experience dealing with Ethereal horrors to handle this mission. Will you be my champion? Uh, we're gonna accept it, or we could ask about the Dermaptor brands. Wrapped around. Um, I, I mean, I think we should accept it. That's that's definitely a danger. Okay. Well, we can ask about the Dermaterrans and then accept it. Probably. They're Dermaptan Durant. <laughs> Dermaptans. Um, yeah, I want to ask about that because I don't. Are you talking about to those. Douglas? Look, I'd love to solve all the world's problems, but unfortunately, I do not have the troops to send them out on a bug hunt. Douglas and the other farmers will just have to accept it for now. Perhaps later, once the Ethereals and the Cathanians have been dealt with, then I can think about sending some men out to the fields to clear out this infestation. Oh, those were the bugs. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the things we need to clear out from the other guy. Yeah, yeah, okay. Um, which need for me to get? Yeah, fronts. yeah. To the north, yep, let's go get the abomination. The All right. And then there's a dude over here with the quest, too. Hold up, hold up. Okay. This book looks like it's back. Book back? Oh, no, nope. maybe not. Just glowing. Well, I was able to click on it, just didn't do anything. Hmm. The weapon master looks over the supplies and size. It's a damn shame about the cannons. This place would feel a whole lot safer if we had a few of those beauties mounted up on the walls. What happened to the cannons? We had no choice but to abandon them on the road when the ethereals attacked us in force. Thankfully, the bastards don't know a thing about artillery. <laughs> what if I recover them? <laughs> then I would call you insane. Treading into that area is nothing short of suicide. There's a reason we call it the conflagration now. It's overrun with ethereals. Even the very ground will cook you alive with the ether fire. You like living? Stay out of that place. Just watch me. Watch me now. <laughs> watch me now. <laughs> We're brave and stupid. Yeah. <laughs> Fine line between bravery and stupidity. There is. Okay. Who are you? Oh, hello there. You startled me. I'm probably not the person you're looking for. You should speak to Douglas if you require assistance. <laughs> You're okay. a useless NPC? Yeah. I don't know, maybe you make food up here. I mean, she looks like she does. What are you? Oh, that's the crafter. The relic guy. I still can't make a relic. Will I get it from brain matter? I got a brain matter. We'll have to get you a brain matter. 
It looks like all of the quest based oh, stuff. There's a dude in here. There's no quest, but there's a bunch of people. This place smells like animals. <laughs> well, it used to be a farm. <laughs> I'd like to thank you. My husband would not have made it if it wasn't for your rescue. Glad you made it. Oh, these are all the people that we just took from the other place. Oh, yeah. You may not think much of it, but you saved my life. For that, I owe you a lifetime of gratitude. You're welcome. Well, hello, stranger. We don't get many visitors out here anymore. Where do you hail from? From Devil's Crossing. None of your business. <laughs> I'd rather not say. I'm good saying they come from yep. Devil's Crossing. Oh, I heard that place got hit pretty hard there in Burwich. Seems you survived, though. There are others. We're running low on food. Burwich is pretty bad shape. It wasn't easy, I can tell you that. Um, um, I think first one. Yeah, I agree. Wish I could help, but we're not doing so hot on supplies ourselves. Talk to my father. Maybe he'll figure something out. Can, can we get a name? Like, I just don't know who your father just is. Maybe him? What brings you to Homestead? What can you tell me about Homestead? Not much to tell. When the attack started, we gathered our neighbors and holed up in here as best we could. Things were looking pretty bad up until the Legion showed up. Now we stand a fighting chance. Okay. Please don't start any trouble. We have enough to go around as it is. Does the Black Legion protect you? As far as I can see, they're only here because it serves their purposes as a defensible location. They take what they want in the name of their dead emperor in order to better serve us. They won't even help us with the Dermaturin infestation. Captain Summer says they pose no threat. We'll see how much of a threat they pose when we all starve to death because the food ran out. I'll see what I can do. Yep. Sounds good. Sounds better than just saying, oh, that <laughs> sucks. Douglas tells me you're going out to Thornsbury and Elmsworth Farms. I hope you're as tough as you look. Dermaturins should not be trifled with. They don't stand a chance against me? Yep. Because we are brave. It's I, stupid. I have guns. I have a shield. I can make fire go out of my hands. Pew, pew. Um, the fields to the west. I want to clear the fields. Let's that, clear the fields. That helps us with Devil's Crossing as well. Yep. Um, but how the hell do we get out to the west? Um, well. So you speak with the emissary. They're at the near homestead. Is it to the west or east? Cause there's fields over this way too. The conflagration is to the east. The rotting croplands and gruesome harvest are to the west. Because world map. Let's try up to the west or to the east then, real quick. Okay. But I'm not sure which one. I thought when they said the to clear out those uh, eggs, I thought they said to the east, to the west. They did. They did. Okay. Well, then that wouldn't be over here. What do we need? This is where we. This is withering fields. Destroy the ethereal amalgamation, maybe. Now I'm mixing them up. Thought that was to the north. Oh, didn't hit him with that. Oh. That uh, fear actually is kind of nice. It took him off of me. Yeah. That dude just, just ran the he's hell gone. away. He's gone. He gone. There he is. <laughs> <laughs> That was oh, hilarious. oh, what the? What? Ooh, I was about dead. Oh, you were about dead. What was killing me? I don't know. Can you turn on fire weapon, though, please? Oh, yep. Oh, look at this pile. I see. Yep. Goopy bodies. Goopy bodies. Oops, reanimator. We should probably get that. Well, we can't anymore. What? Get the request for the, the bounty for the reanimators. That's fine. What what bounty do we have? Ethereal flame, slay. Oh yeah, that's that one. Okay. Yeah. I don't know if that's up here or what it is. Yeah, we already went down through there. Oh, what was that? Uh, I don't know. Someone shot at us. Well, we'll shoot back. Ooh, that looks like the end of the road. Yeah. Not going in that. Yep. Looks like bad news. Bad news. That's on fire. It's yep. also bad news. <laughs> Is that that thing that we saw on fire earlier? <laughs> no, that's a different <laughs> one. <laughs> I remember. Okay. Well, that's. It's obviously giving me an exit to the north. Yeah. Let's see. That one's blocked off over here, right? 
I don't... Yeah, that's fine. Oh, yeah. There we go. Maybe we go out the gate to the north. So remember, we could talk to that guy and said, oh, yeah. out the gate or something. Right. Here, I'm going to sell the one thing I got Oh, no. Quick. The gate's just open. Oh, okay. Well, that makes it easier. <laughs> Walking through... How we walk through a door. Come see what's that left makes of it my easier. Wares. Oh, I don't have anything on me. I Not had a pair of pants stay. drop... Or a shield. Drop a pair of pants. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually a shield. Okay. Um, so... There's, there's a bunch of dudes. Oh, yeah. Thank you for bringing us here. I admit, I was resolved to die in that ditch when you found us, but I found a new purpose here in the fields. These old hands may shake when they hold a sword, but I can still use a rake just fine. Is that the old guy that says he's too old to help? Yeah. With the eye patch on? I think so, yeah. yeah. Blasted dermaterans. An entire year's worth of food is going to go to waste out there. Uh, why has the Black Legion cleared them out? Hell if I know. Summer's only concerned with her war against the ethereals. Then there's that blasted cult. I'm no soldier, so I suppose I'll just keep my mouth shut and work the fields we do have. This is poor soil, not like at the Elmsworth estate. That was some good dirt. Good dirt. Good dirt. Well, at least they're trying to work this. Yep. How do we get out? It'd be nice if they had some guards out here just in case something attacked. Yeah. There's a path down this way. They at least do have that cornered off. They do. With some spikes and stuff, but no guards. Hey, Thornsbury Farm. Oh, there's spikes. Oh, there's stars all around here. Oh, it's these things. It's the centipedes. Oh, okay. Later, centipedes. Yep, we got this. Ugh. Those are the eggs. Oh, okay. This way. Giant centipedes. Oh, wow. He came running. Yeah, the enemies are uh, not walking anymore. Nope. <laughs> oh, there's a quest down there. One second. If one second, just I'm okay. poke my head right here, real quick. Okay. That was a weird noise. That was a weird noise. I heard that too. What do you think that was? That was a, uh, that was a noise. <laughs> There's bugs. Yeah, of course. Oh, they're fast bugs. Fast bugs. Fire tends to work well against what it looks like. It does. Okay, so this goes where the dead end is. Stay north of the road for right now. Okay. And maybe we can go up around there. Yeah, let's go up around there. An apple tree. It's a whole apple orchard. Not Lettuces. sure if it, like, this was a pumpkin orchard. It was. I mean, it still is. It's just kind of nasty now. Can't eat it. Is it still? <laughs> oh, there's a book in here. Yep. Oh, it's the um, her diary. Oh, yeah. Interesting. Can we read? Nope, nope. Oh, oh it's a quest item we have to take back to her. That yeah, I bet that... Well, no, no. Daly is the one that died, right? No, no, no. This one is the one that said... Um, we just talked to her a minute ago. She's standing up on top. She said she didn't have anything to say to us. Oh, okay. I thought Dahlia was that one guy's sister. It's... That was Dahlia. This is a different one. I thought oh. the same thing at first, too. Ooh, what was that? Oh, that's me. I have that now. That's my relic, actually. You have fire come out of your... Everywhere. Everything. Yeah, <laughs> I do, actually. It's like a, a chance on attack proc, basically, to shoot out fireballs in all directions. Fireballs. In all directions. Fireballs in all directions is a winning strategy. <laughs> <laughs> Just didn't stand a chance. All right, we got uh, to the south of the road here. Yep. I see so let's that. go across this fence wall here. And back. I see the thing over there. I'm just trying to okay. trying to make a clean line so that I can remember where we've been and haven't been. That's fair. Devotion level. Oh, cool. Yeah, that's your thing leveling up when you put yeah. it on your ability. 
So it reduces the, if I remember correctly, it reduces the cooldown and gives you longer uh, time for the buff being up. Yeah, I gotta be at 45% or less, but that's why I've got it. <laughs> yep. Throw the bomb. There we go. Didn't want to throw the bomb. I kept hitting it. It wasn't going off. Oh, level 35. Uh, let's figure uh, this is actually just one block, so let's go ahead and clear this one. Achievement unlocked champion. Um, I didn't see that. I just hit level 35 and it showed up immediately after. Uh, I'm 34 still. I got another piece, I think, with uh, XP gain on it. Yeah, it's fine. We're close enough. I'm not too worried about it. Just probably ex explanation why I didn't see it. Yet. Mm -hmm. There. Check inside the house. Yeah. Destroy the table. <laughs> I was stuck on the table. Thanks for. Oh, there's a the body. Thanks for uh, clearing out the. You are more than welcome. That's what I'm here for—to hit things. I was losing to a axe. table. <laughs> Get rid of the chairs too. <laughs> Mass destruction. Can't go through there. Hey, yeah, there we go. Yep, I got it. Must be for just being level 35. Yeah, it's just generally awesome. It's here. Looks like there's a um, rift gate to the east over there somewhere. No, that's just the one that we came in. Ah, never mind. <laughs> never mind, I just saw it on the minimap. Yep. I'm trying to actually keep track of where I am, and I'm not doing a good job. Um, okay, we've gone through there. We didn't hit that top corner, but that should be fine. Let's go through this way. Maybe it'll go back around through. No, it's back near the town. Oh, it's okay. just like a little tiny sliver I didn't hit. Got it. Huh. Random. That was random. Glad you walked over it. Random. <laughs> Dead people. With health pots. You should have used those. Well, might have been too late. So we have a north path and a south path. I guess just stick on this one for now. Yep. Ooh, infested farms. This one. That goes. Well, that just comes out of that one. Okay. Oh, there's something glowing right here. There's a rock! Rocks don't Vampires blow. Vampires of blood. Here, let's actually circle around in the north back here. Okay. That leads down and around. Bigger booms. Bigger booms is a good thing. Barrel. Okay. It triggered my crit thing. Oh, really? Yeah, I don't know why. <laughs> I'm not even when they hit it. But I had the, the crit thing pop up on my head. It's <laughs> awesome. So that's that's where we came from. Okay. Let's follow this path around then. Uh, we've got north and south here. It's like opening back up into an area. Let's, let's go just, north. Yeah, let's just follow the edge right along here. You're not going to destroy that box? Oh, I can't. Indestructible box. Non in, Non-interactable. Everything exploded. What is that? Oh. It's a hollow log. I'm not sure it's hollow. It's a it's log. A log. Stump. Tree stump. Tree stump. Nope. That's a fence. That is. The bot. The fence boss. Hey, Oop, found the fence. Got anything to sell? <laughs> <laughs> Here, here. Yeah, I know. Here. I'm just covering the edge. Ooh, look at that. I know. There's a treasure chest in there too. I know. We're we're going in the building. Okay. Just... How do we get in the building? Uh, bugs. 
We get in the building by bugs? Yeah. Oh! There's a... Someone's shooting at us. Thing. Eyeball. Offer. Oh, hey. Cleanse the shrine. What the... They came out of the house. They wanted to... Yeah, they just walk weird. Yeah. I... Hold on. I'm trying to... That might be the thing where the, that's been glowing for a long time. Ah. I'm trying not to just shove my face in it real quick. <laughs> I don't want to shove my face in it. Uh, okay, come in through this way. Okay. What do we got? There's a jug. And a treasure chest. Hmm. I think I just got a skull too. Oh, there's another treasure chest. There is an upstairs, one second. Oh, there is. And that ether fire hurts. Yeah, there's nothing up here, too. I'm a little bit faster through that. Yeah. Ow, hot. Um, one second, I want to see. Oh, that's a two hander. Ooh, yeah. That one's not bad at all. I got a green one-hander. Oh, it's poison damage. Never mind. This one's got um, life steal, but it's got veil of shadow, which is not me. Not you? You're not a veil of shadow? Nope, I am not a veil of shadow. I You're may, a veil uh... of fire. No, I'm a beacon of light. Hmm. Yeah, of course. Oh. They're coming in through all set. Oh, Hi. yeah, they are. Wow, they sure are. That one's shooting the side of the building. Yeah. You're Is doing a hitting? good job out there. Is he hitting anything? Oh. Hit the side of the building. Okay. Oh, what the? Completed quest or something. Yep, I know. It was, but my, uh, my mouse pointer came up. Oh, I see. So I almost dragged it off and was, like, clicking other things in accident. <laughs> Seek out the hidden treasure. Hm. Cut a line back. That dude took off too. He did. He was feared. Okay, come back this way. Follow the edge of this field. Kind of doing like a zigzag back forth thing because I don't have. And then let's close in on the middle here. Okay. Get a star. He's going down though. Not a very heroic hero. No. They need better heroes. Yeah, they do. They, uh. Enrique Iglesias. <laughs> it, really? Is uh, that what when when you think of hero, is that what comes to mind? Enrique Iglesias? Yeah, he sang that song. I can be your hero, baby, right? He did. I don't. I, I only know he sang. Uh, what was it? I don't know. I it's don't know. Not the right kind of music yeah. for me to know. The... I know one song from him back from when I was younger. I thought he sang a song called "I Could Be Your Hero, Baby." He may have. He may very well have. So we've got kind of like going south down through that path there. We can open that and then try to just travel it west. Or we can try to take the north and go to south. Hmm. So do we go west right now, uncovering all the north area, and then go south from there? Or do we go to the east and try to travel west from that? I have a feeling... You think that goes very far south? Well, I have a feeling it's going to be almost like a... Uh, Southwest is the way it's going to travel. Okay. So no matter which way we go, we're going to have the same problem to where we're going to have to backtrack off of that. Let's let's go south first. All right. So Look back. at that area, and then we can continue from there. Oh, here's uh these guys. Yeah, we've seen these guys in a little bit. Some walking out of the door as well. Bad guys. Yeah, that's bad guys. These guys are shooty bad guys. Can't tell where the door is. There it is. <laughs> I'm shooting the side of the wall because I couldn't figure out where the door was. There's your chest out back. There's a book in here. I had a Walter's, Walter's notes. Note. Walter, that name sounds familiar. Oh. Um, yeah. 
There's a shoot it. There we go. <laughs> but no treasure here. What is that? Boots. What? Nope. Elemental boots. No. Elemental's not bad for me necessarily. No? Um here. Nope, nope, nope. This button. I have some other elemental pieces. It just depends. See it's fire, movement, piercing. I don't know. Try it. Let's see. Thirty. Six fifty five. Six fifty seven. I'm insane slightly more. I gain movement speed. Pierce resistance. Plus two to burst bursting rounds. Must be one of your abilities. Yeah, which one's bursting rounds? Explosive strike. Fire strike. See bursting rounds. Bursting rounds. Ooh, I'll take plus two to that. Absolutely. Okay. Good deal. Yeah, that's actually interesting what is amarasta's ah that stupid noises yeah uh, i got one too amarasta's blade burst sounds like something a night blade would have yeah that's interesting that it's got those two things on it because mm -hmm. that's inquisitor and maybe i don't know something else yeah oh hey there's a book got things to read okay read the things yeah read those war keeper oh, just nice. got an achievement um Achievement unlocked lore keeper. It showed up in the game too. <laughs> yeah, I read a few things as well. Um, all right, let's go back around this way. Okay. We have killed enough for the field opening, right? The eggs and stuff. Um, yeah, I believe we have. Sure that you uh, return to Douglas and Homestead. Yeah. Yep, so now it's just a matter of finding either the ethereal amalgamation or... Okay, so this didn't actually go very far, so it's actually better we went this way. Hey, you chose the right way! Yay! 50% of the time I get it right. When there's two options. When there's two options. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if your ratio is quite at 50%. <laughs> Alright, so we did actually uncover that direction. I don't know... We shouldn't just pop back real quick. So Probably here, should. And uh, turn that in because that might span to something. Yep. That sounds good. We have the other turn in there as well. Yeah, we got her turning up top. Yeah. Any progress with the Dermapterans? Derma Dermapterans? <laughs> Dermap. I, I think the P is silent. Dermaterans? Derm Dermaterans? Yeah. That's how I'd say it. Dermaterans. I've cleared out the fields as you asked. I'm relieved to hear that, and that you've returned in one piece. Dermaterans should not be trifled with, especially in such numbers. I will speak to Captain Summer about sending some guards out along with some of the farmers. We'll have that field cleaned up in no time. In the meantime, I was hoping you would hear me out on a far more grave task. What is it? The Dermateran hives are cyclical in nature. Every seven years or so, they birth a new queen, which promptly proliferates their numbers and causes them to explode across the countryside. In the past, we would rally together and exterminate the queen while she was still young. But after the Grim Dawn, the Dermaterans were allowed to thrive, and their queen has molted into a massive creature that spawns new Dermaterans by the dozen every day. She has to be destroyed. Otherwise, the insects will eventually run out of food and attack us in force. The queen is always guarded by two of her grand viziers, so you'd have to acquire their pheromone glands to even enter her chamber. We know that the Royal Hive is somewhere out in the rotting croplands to the west of Homestead. After the way you handled the infested fields, I'm confident in your abilities. Will you help us halt the Dermatarian reproductive cycle? I will gladly pull together all of our iron beds if you can pull this off. I will slay a Dermatarian's queen. We don't need your money, dude. Well, also, can I just, like, catch it on fire? Right? Why do I need... You're going to need their gland to get in. <laughs> or a left thing on fire and shove it in the hole and go, ha! Yep. <laughs> Deal Absolutely. with that, Dermot Terrence. <laughs> Looks like it's warm down there. How, how's it feeling? 
Mm-hmm. Ooh, I got a uh, The Lost Will of Marthos Everbrook. Oh, I think I read that. Try and read it and see if it goes. Oh, you got it, too. Come see what's left of my wares. 20% pure damage, 108 health. Probably Oh no, I get plus two to burst round. I'm not messing with that. Right. I have a bag. Nope. Two guns that I will put next to the well. Got magic heavy boots. 20 physique, 22 cunning, 4% health. Um, nope, go ahead and sell. Attacks. Uh, nah, it's all poison. Oh, I got another thing here. Excerpt. Oh, that's the uh, excerpt from her diary. Oh, okay. Come see oh, what's left of my wares. You'll see anything you like. Crap of stats on it, but it's all poison, mm. acid, ethereal, poison, vitality. Yeah, it's none of the damage I do. Okay. See you around. I am. Let's go turn in that quest up top real quick. Okay. I'm gonna push you. Thank you for clearing out our farm. It's the best news I've heard in weeks. Found your diary. Oh, heavens. I hope you didn't read it. It's not proper to stick your nose into a lady's private scribblings. Thank you. I dropped it when we fled the farm. Figured the Dermaterans would have shredded it by now. The first place you go to is, uh... I hope you didn't read it. <laughs> <laughs> I assure you have not read a word, lie, or your secret is safe with me. Wink. <laughs> uh, I think we shouldn't lie. I'll say your secret is safe with me. <laughs> Wink. There we go. And oh, I there's actually... no comment. All right. Thank you for returning my diary to... Okay. Writing helps me relax, and even now with the word as it is. You know, I have to turn it in as well. Yep. Should I lie? No, I should do the same. You do whatever you want to. I'm going to tell the truth. There we go. Uh, Mama was talking about you. She said that she'd stick her nose in the book. Uh, I found it. I was brought it back to Mama. Yeah. Oh, okay. that's nice of you. I want to go drop some stuff in the bank. Okay. Actually, before we go back out, might end this one here. All right. Something you need stashed. Uh, do you want to auto sort? Yes. That's not actually what I wanted to do. Stash. Together. Sort. And look at these two things. It's safe with me. Promise. I'll keep an eye on this. Come see what's left of my wares. I think I'm sorted. Okay. Good Same here. All right, where are you at? Right by the front gate. All right, we'll end it here for this one, and next time we will pick up with stuff on the right, like normal. <laughs> Sounds good. See you then. Bye. Bye.